is good everybody welcome back to another my name toys video today we're back with a brand new wwe elite 2 pack on the ringside exclusive wwe elite 2 pack mega powers macho man randy savage and hulk hogan figures now i'm very excited for this wave not a wave more of a you know it's just a it's a conditional two pack we got a nice looking two pack right here we have a brand new macho man with brand new skin tone you know that same tone we've seen from hulk hogan over a number of figures we've seen in the last couple years very excited for this pack i felt like you know it been a minute since we saw it versus getting it in hand. I think the packaging and the figures, like kind of the, you know, the last prototype sort of sample figures have been finished for a while. I want to say way back at Comic-Con. So it's been a little bit. I didn't expect it to take this long, but here it is. You know, it's in our hands now and we can build a bridge and get over it finally. Even though I'll hold on to that grudge forever. I'm kidding, but I'm dead ass serious. All jokes, but am I kidding? Yes, of course. Don't Nonetheless, here is our packaging block WWE logo, WWE Elite logo up here. You got the Mattel True Effects. You get a beautiful, beautiful shot of Macho Man and Hulk Hogan in here doing the hand shaking hand right here. Ringside exclusive where you can get this at, you know, WrestlingFigures.com. Use promo code MDTOYS to save yourself 10%, of course, when you're shopping over there. But nice Mega Powers 2-pack coloring. Macho Man Randy Savage, Hulk Hogan on the side. You get an image of both men. WWE block logo on the back. Got a little bio read. If you'd like to read it, you can pause it now. Another WWE logo, Elite collection. You got the Mega Powers on the back here. Nice images there. WWE.com, all the different mess. On the other side, you got Mega Powers on the side with the WWE Elite logo. Pretty beautiful mock packaging right here. I, I actually like it a lot, but I don't typically collect WWE Elite's men on card. Honestly, wish I, I could. You know, I have a long list of figures. I'd like to have men on card, maybe autograph one day, but I don't know. It's just yeah, I don't really have the space for it, and I didn't start off that way, and it's kind of hard to go back and do it now, but maybe one day. You never know, but let's try the hell up, crack the Mega Powers out of the packaging, find out what they're about, and see how these guys will compare to the rest of our Macho Man and Hulk Hogan figure collections. Alright guys, so here's the Mega Powers out of their packaging. Liking what I'm getting into, man, I think it's pretty cool here. If you guys will notice, my rotating base, actually, I dropped it last time I reviewed something, and it smashed glass everywhere, and it has shattered, as you guys can see. So I am in the process of either, I may just break all the glass out and have it as a white base, or I thought about buying a new one, maybe with some LED lights on it. I don't know. I, I can play around with that. Maybe you can leave a recommendation down in the comment section below, but I'm enjoying this two-pack. Of course, this is a two-pack, so what we're going to do is we are going to look at their accessories together because you do get both figures it's not a you know separate pack when you buy this you get both figures both accessories all those things so we are going to do the this review together we're going to look at their accessories together what all you get what all the two pack entails and we'll break it all down man but let's shut the hell up get into the accessories and break down hulk hogan and macho man randy savage all right guys, so as you guys know with the ring set exclusives they always come with this like trifold background but you do get the nice like creamy sky cloud decent background here with like a gradient black wash smoky look finish to it but it says mega powers on it and it is just the piece of cardboard right there so i did want to include that in the accessories before we got into it because you do get this it is kind of the background of the packaging when you're looking at it mint on card but did want to talk about this a little bit you know it's for your displays you can set that up yeah you may could do it as a background for an interview or something but you do have this for the shelf if you'd like it all right guys so getting into the mega powers accessories that you get now we're not going to get into the main head sculpts or the hands that they already have we'll get into that when we review the figures themselves. But you do get a decent amount of accessories here. We do get a WWF Championship. Very quality. You know, we've seen these over the years a lot, and they always do a good job. I always like and enjoy Mattel's Championship, so I don't have an issue with that. We got the blue globe in there. It's looking pretty quality. I think they could improve the way this championship looks. I think it be, could be thinner, maybe, and, like, maybe some of the details better applied, maybe. But I think, overall, it looks pretty good. I don't know. You know, I, I think, overall, it does well. Outside of that, each character in this two-pack does get a cloth goods accessory. You do get the tank top with the rip away in the middle that's velcro and then you do have the signature cuts in the back synonymous with hulk hogan you guys know how it is i know a lot of people would like a version that doesn't velcro and they you know it doesn't tear away in the front and i think they discussed possibly doing that in the future but they like to have that feature for people that don't have the shirt already but we've seen this shirt before hulk rule shirt looks pretty good I have no issues with it always good to get a cloth goods accessory now for macho man's accessory very very quality man we've seen these from mattel a few times over the years but he does have the big mega powers 
robe slash entrance duster vest deal. It's got mega powers on the back. It's almost like a gigantic flag. You got the star, you got the lightning bolts, mega powers on the back. Very quality. It does tie around the neck and the front, but this is the kind of stuff we love as collectors, man. Really brings the setup to life. Really brings everything full circle, and I think that everybody would agree with that. I, I love this. I think this is great. Feels great. Feels quality, and we've seen these over the years, like I said, but this is nice. At least I believe we have seen a few of these before, right? Maybe. Am I tripping? I guess maybe, like, we had the Defining Moments version, right? That wasn't quite like this. We've seen, I've seen a lot of custom ones, so maybe we haven't really seen one of, you know, exactly like this from Mattel, but we've seen jackets and stuff, but this is nice. This is really awesome. I think that it'd be cool to get more of these, and I'm sure we will because this will not be the last time we get Macho Man in this skin tone and the way this guy looks. It's gonna be, you know, we're gonna continue to get him forever, so this is very nice. Now, outside of that, you do get a Macho Man headband that's got the nice golden scroll kind of going all the way there. We've seen the sculpt before. I do believe it's got the red and yellow on there that does fit the head sculpt nice. Kind of big on this tongue out head sculpt. Like, geez, that almost like falls off. Oh my god. Let's see if it fits the smiley head that comes on the figure. Yeah, it's it's too big. Did this come with the Miz or something? I can't remember. I want to say this came with somebody already, but it doesn't really fit the Macho Man head sculpt very well. As you guys can see, it's pretty damn big. So I don't know. That's something to think about. We also get headwear for Hulk Hogan. You got the Hulkamania headband in here. Now, we did see this on the Defining Moments Hulk Hogan way back in the day, but you know, you pour it in there right there, and it never, for me, it never fit right. For whatever reason, I could never just get this to work right. Maybe I should plug it in on this side and then have this come around here and kind of I don't see just God in heaven. I'll, I'll look at it when we look at the Hulk Hogan itself I'll get into that. But you do get the headband. Outside of that you also get Macho Man sunglasses in the orange and black. We've seen this mold quite a few times before so it's nothing you know radical or anything like that. It looks pretty good you know fits the figure well. We do get this brand new Hulk Hogan eyes closed head sculpt and I think this looks really good. Look at this sculpt in here I think the hair color is good. The, the, the eyes closed looks really clean the mustache looks really clean again man they're gonna give us so many options for hulk hogan there's just so many figures so many head sculpts and i'm just glad to see a new head sculpt you know i'm glad to see we didn't get any reuse here we do get a brand new head sculpt so if you guys want this two-pack for this head sculpt you are gonna have to track this down but i think the wrinkles look good i think the mustache looks good all of this looks nice i think this is a very quality hulk hogan head and then we have the same head sculpt we got with the target exclusive legends flashback macho man ultimate edition with the tongue out you do get it again here, which isn't my favorite head skull, but it has some likeness to Macho, and it's got the brown hair in there, and you know, it is in the new skin tone, so that has to be noted. Then for interchangeable hands, you get a pair of choke slamming style hands for Hulk Hogan. You get a pair of choke slamming hands for Macho Man in the new skin tone with the white tape. And then you get these signature handshaking hands that is interchangeable, and you guys saw it on the rotating base, so you would plug this into Macho Man, you'd plug this into Hulk Hogan. The only thing is, is there is no hand tape on Macho Man's side. You know, it could be either guy's right hand, doing the handshaking, but this is a very cool mold. You cannot unclasp it. It is, like, glued together in the middle here, so you can, like, separate it, but you guys can see there, the mold is there, so you do want to keep that close so it doesn't look awkward, but this is a very cool touch. I think it's very well sculpted. It looks immaculate. Honestly, it looks like, it looks like hand-shaking hands, so that is what we love to see. That is really quality right there, but this is a really cool accessory, and I think this will make, you know, displays over the top, but that is all of the accessories you get in this two-pack of the Mega Powers. All right, guys, so getting into the Hulk Hogan from this two-pack. This is the Defining Moments head sculpt, I'm pretty sure, just with true effects with the updated skin tone. I think it looks really good. I like the likeness. I like the mustache. The expression is good. If it's not the Defining Moments head sculpt, you're ba I mean, what you're looking at on this figure is basically an updated version of that Defining Moments Hulk Hogan, which figure I didn't have. It was at my Kmart. I've told the story multiple times. It's at my Kmart for like a decade. Not really, but it was at my Kmart for a very long time, and I never purchased it, man. I saw it there. It went on clearance and I was just like god I don't want this it's so blagum never grabbed it for whatever reason and here I am hate to see it but double jointed arms updated skin tone true effects on the head sculpt you do get the mega powers trunks now which is cool you do get the graphic on the back right there and the mega powers with the star get the beefy thighs red knee pads same exact knee pads from the defining moments same exact boots from the defining moments so it's basically a repaint updated version of the defining moments figure but it is very quality now if you want Hulk Hogan in those mega power trunks 
Trunks, this is the way to go. I guess you could get a different Hulk Hogan figure and then just slap a Mega Powers decal on it, which would probably be cheaper, but you do get some cool accessories in this in this bundle, and I think the Macho Man makes the pack worth it alone. But I like this Hogan a lot, you know? I, I think it's very quality. All Hulk Hogan figures, especially the ones we've gotten the last couple years, are very nice. And You know, it's, it's a run-of-the-mill Hogan, but he's got the Mega Powers on the back, and it's a very quality figure. I like how beefy he is. I like how big he is, and he looks really good. I think you, if you're a Hulk Hogan fan, this figure you're gonna you're gonna enjoy this figure and that's kind of you know that's kind of how it is but before we get into comparisons let's get into macho man now for this macho man figure we're getting the same exact head sculpts we saw on his target exclusive ultimate edition you know it's the smile it's the same as the ultimate edition but it does have the updated skin tone this is the first macho man we're getting in this skin tone to match hulk hogan really like the muscular shoulders they gave him with the double jointed big arms got the nice macho man torso in here he has the same exact matching mega powers trunks as hulk hogan of course white wrist tape really quality tights going on. You got the big red knee pads. He's got the white knee sleeves on there, which I think is a great detail. He's got his two stars on his boots there. It's very washed out because of the bright yellow and white, but it's very good. I like this Macho Man. I like this formula for Macho Man as well. I'm actually enjoying it quite a bit. So this Macho Man figure is pretty damn good. I, I love that the muscular shoulders are on here. I mean, you're getting some really quality stuff here. I like this mod. This might be, I don't know. I, I'm just, uh, I'm throwing shish at the wall here. With the updated shoulders and the double jointed arms and the way the skin tone with the tan and everything this may be my favorite macho man we've seen so far now would i like to see other macho men like i think they could update the defining moment someday with this updated formula updated skin tone updated things and i think that would probably throw that figure over the top as great as that figure is already but this is still really nice and I i'm enjoying the macho man but as far as macho man and hulk hogan figure comparisons so for your hulk hogan and macho man figure comparisons guys here is every hulk hogan outside of the coliseum collection ultimate edition that is coming in very soon i ordered it should be here very soon. I mean, look at all of these Hulk Hogan's we've got, and they're virtually all the same. I mean, you're looking at five Hulk Hogan's right here that are almost the exact same outside of a few different parts choices here and there. Different head sculpts, like same knee pads, same boots. I mean, they have reused the hell out of this mold, and this is the same exact figure, except it doesn't have, you know, it's got a different head sculpt, different headband, and then it has mega powers on the butt. So, you know, but I, I still like it. I still enjoy it. You got a lot of red and yellow. You got a lot of bleach blonde hair. I mean, what? What? What do you want, man? Pretty insane to even look at, but uh, they're going to keep coming, and that's just the way it is. We're going to continue to get Hulk Hogan's, and this isn't even including the, the Hollywood Hogan's we've gotten, the few elites that are coming in the main elite line. So, I mean, you have the SDCC exclusive, the Survivor Series Elite, the Elite 94. That's the Elite 96, you dumb bastard. The current Mega Powers RSC 2-pack, the Ultimate Edition, the Fan Takeover Ultimate Edition, and then, of course, Macho Man here at the end. Now, as far as your Macho Man figure comparisons are concerned, here we have, you know, the Slim Jim SDCC exclusive. You've got the Early Bird Ultimate Edition. You have the other Ultimate Edition. Then you have the other Ultimate Edition. So, you know, I don't know if you guys are uh, liking this skin tone more or this skin tone more. Obviously, this one is probably a lot more closer to that one. But, I mean, maybe this one looks a bit more natural. But at the same time, I, I don't know. I like both of them. But I just like this formula, man. I like the updated beastly shoulders and the way this figure looks a whole lot. So, I don't know, man. I'm just, uh, I'm really digging this new one compared to the others. But you guys can let me know note down in the comment section below this one's got kind of a bobblehead i don't know what's going on with that but you got the madness nwo macho there but yeah this macho man's fire and i'm telling you man we're gonna get ultimate editions in this skin tone we're gonna get new elites just like this coming soon i guarantee it no doubt about it i don't even you know i'd fight somebody it, it's coming it's gonna happen but that's all i got but i think that pretty much wraps up this wwe elite two-pack review on the ringside exclusive mega powers macho man randy savage and hulk hogan figures man had a lot of fun with this review i think that you know, the, if you want the Mega Powers in that Mega Powers gear, you're going to have to go after this. I think it is, like, no doubt about it. The, don't worry. If you don't want this version of Macho Man in this specific gear, I am about 1 trillion percent confident we're going to get Ultimate Editions in this skin tone. We're going to get Elites in this skin tone. They're going to update Macho Man to match Hulk Hogan in that sort of, uh, in that tan. You know, they're going to do that. I, I highly, I highly anticipate that coming true. I like both of these figures a lot. I know the Hulk Hogan is basically a re-release just with Mega Powers gear and you know they throw it in there with a brand new Macho
Macho Man. That's not like too, too different, but I think that you get some really awesome accessories. I think that a lot of people are going to want this two pack. I know a lot of people have been waiting on this two pack, so I think it's awesome. I, I really do like it. Now, if you're, you know, we're going to end up getting like every version of Hulk Hogan, and they've already tried to, the, to touch on that already, man. So there's plenty of options here. Now we all look dumb for not getting that Miss Elizabeth from Elite Series 77. I think that thing shot up in price now. I used a couple of mine to make customs, and now I don't even have one. So that is the thing about collecting, man. You never know. Maybe I can track one down. Of course, you're going to have to have one, but I hate I didn't have one for the video. I do apologize for that. But at the end of the day, guys, if you would like to grab this two-pack, go over to Ringside Collectibles. Use promo code MDTOYS to save yourselves 10%. I love the Macho Man. The Hulk Hogan, we've seen so many times before. It's just different trunks, basically. The Macho Man is sick as hell. I really like the Macho Man. It may be one of my favorite Macho Men figures we've ever gotten. I just really like the look of it. It feels really good in the hand. I love the double jointed arms and like the skin tone makes a difference. I I'm just enjoying the Macho Man a whole lot more than the Hulk Hogan right now, but I've always liked Macho Man more than Hogan, I, I guess. I don't know, but anyways, that is going to wrap this video up. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. Leave me your thoughts on this two-pack down in the comment section below if you grabbed it. Is it worth it? But I'm getting out of here. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a blessed one, and I'll see you next time.